What is up everybody? It is Dragonfly Todd here coming at you with a brand new video and today we're going to talk a little bit about identity but first off I want to say I have not talked about it in a long time on my channel. I haven't talked about it. Haven't I have thought about it a lot. I've been following it. I've been seeing everything that people have been saying about it. I've been seeing everything that they have said in response and guys I, I'm kind of torn at the moment. Um, I know that it's gonna release like I know that it's coming out but here's the deal like I don't want it to get stuck in this weird stage of development like my one of my previous favorite games did it was called Daisy standalone I love that game I had like 2,000 3,000 hours in that game and then they just completely dropped it like they dropped the ball and I really hope that the identity developers don't make that same mistake like we're talking about a town square module and first off, like, uh, they just said that they were going to do a stream of the Town Square module. And I'm pretty excited for it. I'm not even going to lie. I want to see what we're going to be able to do. But they said that they wanted to keep it a secret at first. But I think that they're starting to realize that they're going to lose the, the bulk of their supporters over, like, them thinking that they're, they're not delivering on these promises that they're making. And that they're thinking that these are all false promises. Like, guys... I had, let's, I think it was 70 dislikes on a video where I defended identity and that I defended the developers. And I'm telling you right now, that's kind of unnecessary. <laughs> like, I'm entitled to my own opinion. That was an old video, and there were, like, it, it did seem like it was going to come out way sooner than it was actually, go like, coming out. But, like, I'm gonna tell you guys right now it's been what three or four years that they've been in development and for most games like especially with indie games like they take much much longer like even Red Dead Redemption has been taking a long time and it's been getting delayed and that's uh, the simple fact that like games are hard like it's hard to develop a game and it's you only get one chance like you only get one shot to actually get it out there to everyone and everyone to continue playing it because look at what no man's sky did they just started to where they're gonna have a player model and you're gonna have multiplayer and all this stuff but they waited too long their their fan base is gone they had millions and millions and millions of people watching and identity the developers of it they have one shot to get town square right and if people start playing town square and it's a complete bust do you really think they're going to stick around for the other modules and support the development further no they're not there's going to be nobody on the servers nobody's going to want to play it they're going to get bored within the first 10 minutes but they really want to make a good game like they want to make a good module star citizens modules for example they're very good they were they were good okay they were good and they were still boring like there's not a lot to do in them and they've been they've been improving on it improving on it but i haven't played star citizen in like months okay the best thing about star citizen is clanning up and making groups and making all this other stuff and you can barely do any of that at the moment because everything's so out of whack they want to make sure that they're not going to be out of whack. They want to make sure that they have all their ducks in a row before they actually release it to the public. And that's what a lot of game developers fail on doing. Now, I'm not going to sit here and say that I'm going to support them for the next three years if they still don't release this module because, let's be honest, guys, I'm looking for problems that are going to be in this module. It's not going to be a perfect game because it's a module it's not it's not a finished game yet and i think the developers really need to understand that there's a fine line between making amazing making an amazing product and making a i guess you would say like reachable product because you can't always shoot for the stars this is in begin this is in the beginning you what needs to happen is they need to release it as soon as this bug tracker and whatever is done what do we have 10 11 12 tasks left they need to release it right after this or they're gonna lose everyone and now I'm not gonna sit here and say that game development is easy because it's not it's really 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 hard but you guys you gotta you gotta get it going man this there's this is a problem like it's it was an issue 
whenever it was supposed to be released in quarter one of 2017 and you have you have lost 65 percent of your of your fan base you've lost 65 percent of those people nobody's nobody's talking in the discord about the game nobody's hype the hype is the hype is relatively lost there needs to be something there needs to be a game like actual gameplay to bring your followers back you have got to do something this is the time you as soon as this bug tracker gets done you guys need to release the game and i'm not even gonna lie every time i see the the dev tracker the blog the dev blog thing and it said and we're about we're supposed to be getting the game it's supposed to be released Every time I see it and it says it's been a crazy couple of months here in an asylum, I know that it's about to get delayed again because it's happened many, 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 many times. And now I'm not going to sit here and bash it because I support the developers. I'm one of the rare few people still supporting the game and not trying to talk trash about it. But this is a, this is a legitimate issue and this is a legitimate problem and I feel like it needs to be addressed other than somebody than saying that y'all are sorry like and i really do get it i understand i know that i couldn't make a game myself with all that needs all these servers and needs all this stuff but like i really want this to succeed because it's a game that i've been wanting for almost my entire life i've wanted a game like this where you could just rp where it's a dedicated rp game where you can do pretty much anything and the sky's the limit. And that's what identity is supposed to be. That's what the game plan is here. And we do not need to forget that. Like identity is supposed to be this crazy upcoming new I new RPG that's gonna break the barriers for everything else. But games who have, games that have been even announced after identity was supposed to be released have already released and that's not a good thing like people are figuring out that they can get that that they can get that fix in other games and there have been many games that have been released that i'm going to start covering as well and i really hope that just because all this stuff has been happening it doesn't make it to where my channel dies out and I'm very sorry that I haven't been posting but I got really destroyed with grades and now now I'm back I'm coming back for good this time even if YouTube is smacking me around telling me I need a thousand subscribers to monetize my videos I know that one day I'll have them I'll have I'll have a billion subs okay I know that's gonna happen but identity you got to get your trash and in the line you got to put the trash in the trash can okay the garbage man is coming out after this dev blog tracker thing is is done like you need you need to do it or you're gonna miss your window games have a window who talks about Red Dead Redemption anymore I haven't heard anything about Red Dead Redemption but we know it's gonna come out and we know identity is gonna come out but it needs to be soon because there's this fine line where hype can only go so long and a fan base can only stick around so long and that's honestly what that's about it like that's it just needs to change there needs to be there needs to be something other than you know <laughs> you know development blogs where you're making art I, I enjoy those I watch them occasionally but I'd rather see some raw gameplay footage okay I want to I want to see what possibilities are in the town square I'm really hoping that this isn't gonna be just a 10 minute thing that I play for 10 minutes and then I'm bored with it because if that's the case this is all been for nothing anyway guys I just want to make it clear that I'm not bashing identity or its developers I actually am in high support of them I just really really feel strongly that there's this window of time and that everything I've said in the video is very well analyzed and true and I feel like that I can make a change I feel like I can help and it's not just me bashing them for no reason anyways I'll see you guys in the next video make sure you leave a like if you enjoyed the video if you agree with me whatever if you want to leave a comment tell me your thoughts but don't just leave a dislike because that just it hurts my feelings and i cry every night because of them see you guys in the next video peace